Oh yeah, they're getting after it. <laughs> what is going on guys? Good morning. It is finally the day for the Champions League second semi-final. This is the Liverpool versus Barcelona semi-final and obviously there's so much hype around it. It's an unstoppable force versus an immovable object and it's Messi versus Salah. It is, it is going to be amazing guys and so before we sort of get into our preview or our thoughts of the match, maybe a match prediction, we're going to look at some of the events that are taking place around Barcelona at the moment, including Barcelona fans, Barcelona police, Barcelona civilians, uh, Liverpool fans. It's it's just a, a madness right now. And it actually, it, there, there are parts that look like they would, they would be enjoyable to be around. It would be a fun atmosphere to be in. And then there are some parts where it's just... Uh, a bit too much. It's it's a bit too a bit too much violence. A, way too much police presence. Way way too much Liverpool hooliganism, uh, and then some some sad events with like pushing civilians in fountains. I, I did I didn't get the video for that. Uh, I decided I, I was gonna keep it nice. I was gonna keep it focused on the match day and rather than on the terrible events that took place. Why would you push random people in, in fountains and think that's okay? They're just going about their day. They probably don't even care about football. Uh, but yeah, we're going to take a look at, at some of some of the Liverpool fans in Barcelona. You guys need to let me know some of your predictions for the match down in the comments below. And let's get to the video. As well, guys, you can find the original video just down in the description below. This is just a basic video on Liverpool fans in Barcelona. I believe it's just chanting. So so yeah, let's, let's take a listen. Oh yeah, they're getting after it. I'm not gonna lie, I'm chanting with them, but I don't want Liverpool to win. I don't want either team to win, I'm not gonna lie to you. Liverpool or Barcelona, I don't have a favorite in this. It's very hard to pick a favorite for this match. We're, we're rooting for Ajax secretly. They all look like they're on holiday. Look like they're having a great time. Got a nice couple pints. Literal pints. Got a ton of glasses everywhere. And they're in a fountain. I believe this is the same fountain that a person got pushed into. I don't think this is the square that I'm thinking of. This, like, in Barcelona. I hope it's not. Because if so, that would be... That'd be a little sad. Oh yeah, we'll, we'll finish off. We'll finish off the video. We'll have to get them a lay, a lay, a lay chance in. Uh, this, it does make you kind of hype, though. It really does. It really does make you kind of hype for the game. Uh, but yeah, guys. So sort of my my thought process behind this was seeing all the all the events that were happening in in downtown Barcelona uh, around the stadium and around where the Liverpool fans were. I just wanted to get you know Liverpool fans, please be safe, but also at the same time, please hold each other accountable. Obviously, all of the hooliganism, some of it is is fun for the game, but then some of it is detrimental to not only Barcelona, it's detrimental to the image of Liverpool fans, Liverpool itself. It just doesn't look good. Uh, when people are not keeping other fans in check when they're pushing random people in fountains, ruining other people's days, just these random bystanders, you, you have to hold yourselves accountable. Uh, and as, as a Chelsea supporter, I, I mean, I'm not really the best one to talk about that. Uh, it's, well, I guess here in America, it's not really the biggest issue with Chelsea supporters, uh, but Chelsea supporters itself, there's a lot of, obviously, in institutional racism issues, and I always try to hold, hold Chelsea fans themselves accountable, and I hope you guys will as well. Um, but otherwise, I, I hope Liverpool fans have fun. I hope this is going to be an amazing game in itself. Uh, Barcelona versus Liverpool, the first leg at the new camp or the Camp Nou, uh, it's, it's, it's going to be so good, guys. So you guys need to let me know some of your predictions. I, I, I will I will do. I will say this game will end two two. That's that is my hope. I hope it's a goal fest. I really do hope it's a goal fest uh, because these are two, we want to see the attacking prowess of both of these teams. I'll actually I'll re, I'll, I'll redo it. I'll say two one Barcelona. I think Liverpool will get an away goal uh, and it'll it'll be Barcelona though because because Messi Messi versus. Messi versus Andrew Robertson. Andy Robertson is going to have a hand, his hands full. 
I mean, but it's still going to be an amazing game, guys. It really is going to be such a good game. Uh, but you guys need to let me know, once again, your thoughts down in the comments below on not only the Liverpool fans, uh, Barcelona itself, the police presence in Barcelona, uh, the match itself. Let me know some of your predictions. Uh, and thank you guys so much for watching. Hope we all have a good day. Hope, hope we get some very, very good, hope we get a very good finish to the Champions League week. But thank you guys so much for watching, and peace.